vaccination, vaccinated nation. It's time to open up and have a proper vacation. <laughs>I don't know if anybody's ever eaten their Carvel. I don't think cake like this. But. We just got to Alabama. Get me, I'm losing it. <laughs> I honestly want to just like eat that so bad, but I know myself it's gonna hurt. It's gonna feel bad. We are, ooh, look at this car. When we arrived here in Alabama, we're in Tillman's Corner on our way to the Gulf Coast. The car hours ago is like this. I just went inside to tell them about it and said I didn't want to. Car, and she was, oh yeah, it's been like that all day and we're not judging either because we don't know whose car it is. I'm like, I guess everybody. <laughs> I don't know why it's so funny. There's now a motorcycle there. <laughs> they just take off. I mean, I, we left and we went to get food and it's still open. The car door is open. It's all fine. Nobody will touch it. <laughs> Open. Like the motorcycle didn't. Bad. Somebody parked their motorcycle there and didn't touch it either. I feel so bad for them. They were either a just like bringing a ton of luggage in, or they were drunk. I think there's probably a lot of luggage and they just didn't come back. It's exhausted. It's, like we are not in Kansas anymore, India. <laughs> oh my god. It is Ryan and Brian, and we are probably up earlier than we've been up most days, right? Yes, it's uh, 9.30 a.m. Yeah, but I've been up since 4 a.m. And we, uh, I woke up this morning and I just was editing videos. And I was actually really excited to come to this Memorial Park because we only have a day here. We're, we got to Alabama yesterday. We, now we're gonna go to this Memorial Park because this toothless wonder. <laughs> Dad was very sweetly at the Red Roof Inn that was um, in the middle of the She was room. very sweet. She was very, she was sweet. very sweet. And she knew what she was talking about. And I asked her what to do. And she said to do this. We can go on a submarine. Never been on the submarine. What's up, guys? It's Ryan and Brian from the Bro Pit. We are in Mobile, Alabama at the U.S. Battleship Pavilion. <laughs>
Vietnam was this clear war. I said, from what I understand, and I'm not some war buff, but like Vietnam was just one of those wars where people were forced to go over. There were it was complete chaos. It was like just like almost like sacrificing your life. It was just like being, you know, just like committing suicide. Nobody felt passionate about the war, and they just kept committing more troops and more troops. They didn't want to look bad. They just kept more people kept dying. I'm so cannot believe that I have never taken a nap at 10 a.m. because I was falling asleep in a coffee shop. <laughs> I felt so bad. He was up so early. You were probably didn't get any sleep at all last night. Like like and I took my friend Catherine's, you know, her advice, which is, you know, if you're up there and you can't sleep, like stop wasting time in bed. Like just like. Just sleep, you sleep, you need sleep. So I thought, yeah. So I started editing and I got a lot of shit done. I was writing people and I was like, yeah, I'm up. I was like, I'm not, this is, my brain has had its, it had its chance. It's, I'm done. <laughs> I had the last lap because I had two feta croissant. 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 You? <laughs> Technically, I got them as a gift and I re gifted them. Oh. For your birthday. That was, your, that was your birthday gift. That was so good. It is. It's a birthday Sure. I'll make sure. Finally, you're lit up. You were getting a little shadowy on me. I mean, I know that I look like absolute shit. My shadow. No, you look good. Did you get a facial? Yeah, but well, let me see how you look. Oh, put it back on you always. <laughs> I'm kidding. Well, I mean, he does. He's got way more knowledge when it comes to just life in general since he's 15 years older. Oh, was I not supposed to say that? I don't know what's going on with you. But no, you weren't. They predict our freedom of the This is on loan from Pensacola, Florida from the National Aviation Museum. Joking matter, so we really don't want to be irreverent in these videos. We're just trying to keep some life up. I have the utmost respect for anything military-wise and people giving up their lives for our freedom. And I will say I'm always lives. impressed whenever you do thank anybody who's served in the military and that's something that I'm kind of taking on because I've always wanted to. I tried to go to the Air Force Academy but didn't get in. Right. Why did you get in? You didn't pass the test? I didn't pass the test. Construction in Portsmouth, New Hampshire, on November 1st, 1941. Like all submarines, it was named after a species of fish. Drum is a species of fish. Reached Pearl Harbor in 1942. Spent the entire war in the Pacific Ocean to join your
Is Chicago. that oh in Chicago? Yeah. Okay, I'm from Wicker Park. Oh wow! <laughs> yeah, I was like, I sounds familiar. I've yeah. been there. Yeah. And then got some. Fi are you guys all from Chicago? Actually, we're from Florida now. But oh nice! I don't even know where I am anymore. Are we in? Are we in Alabama? We are. <laughs> I'm pleasantly. Oh, well, look at this guy in his nice head of hair. This is where we eat my cars, our cheesy, Chinese checkers. Our cheese, we look at our cheese but it's back in there. I know that's ours. <laughs> Alright. Let's up for getting out of here. Our cheese. Oh, sorry. No, it's okay. It's just getting close up. Oh, we could go this way. Is exit this way? Oh, is it? Yeah. Saying that, of course I can. I love small spaces. Small, cozy spaces. I'm not claustrophobic. Not like Davy Crocs. Not like Crocketeers. He would not be able to handle that. No, he could do with small. His apartment's tiny, but. Yeah, he could have one, actually. He just doesn't. He doesn't. He gets uh, nauseous on the water. He gets. Wow. Now I'm starting to see some shiny. Matches your 
shorts well. You're obsessed with the way I look. Okay, let's move well, on. Well, I'm also obsessed with fashion and making sure you look good and feel good. I'm, yeah. That was one thing I learned from you, Linifer. If you look good, you walk into a room, your confidence level goes. Always. 100%. And I feel like and that's always why I'm energy. telling you. I'm not trying to criticize. I, I always want you to I look. look. I never look. No, no, no. I'm saying I want to just tell you because if you don't like well, look I, like properly. Well, my hair was just like messed up, and I'm tired. So I'm, I'm just tired. Well, what? Can I be tired? Can you? No, you Here, can't be that. tired because if you're tired, you bring that energy on camera. Whenever I joke, it's not okay. Okay, queen, turn around and move. Let's go, girl. <laughs> Look at this. She is mincing Look about her titties are sweating. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Die. Oh my thirst trap. I am thirst so trap. thirsty. Thirst trap alert. You know the only thing is, I admit it. I admit it. I am not it. thirsty. The thing is, I, I would admit it if I was so damn not. Oh, no, no, no. I'm not saying you are. We are. We have not even gone into the entrance. Where are you going? He's got no idea what he's doing. He's cooler with that camera. Now let's go. We're going to make our way to the top. Okay. USS Alabama. You first. I get the camera. Okay. Come on in, guys. Take out my sunglasses, I can't see. Welcome aboard. Ooh. Here we get the battleship reads. You're Beth, I'm Brian, but why? Brian and Ryan, it's a, my answer to take our picture, and after talking, she's from Decatur, Alabama, which is where Tammy Woodsmall is from. Oh, wow, you're so you live there. Did you, were you born and raised there? Oh, no. So I, I lived there the past 18 years. In terms of, like, Madison versus Decatur? Uh, you don't want to know my yeah. opinions on that. <laughs> I do want to know your opinions. What are they? Uh, Madison is much better than the <laughs> Well, you know, Tammy moved to New York City and now she's in Fort Lauderdale. She's never going back. <laughs> so I don't, I don't, I don't think her. she's going to take any events. <laughs> so where's your next adventure right now? Our next adventure is to go back home to Madison. Okay. That's it. We, we maxed out June. Uh, uh, yeah. we, we drove our camper all over. We You're went, so lucky you have a camper. Yeah, we went yeah. to Atlanta and Smoky. Kentucky, um, Kansas City, Missouri, Omaha, Nebraska. What was your favorite? Because I think we're going to be in the well, Kentucky. Well, we, we went to um, Omaha, Nebraska for the baseball college series. Oh, you did. So that was a good was awesome. And then we drove down the Dallas. All right, Beth, John, nice to meet you nice guys. Nice to meet you. Okay. And you guys are vaccinated, obviously. Oh, yeah. Real. We I are. I don't get why people don't get vaccinated. That happened a either. lot in Nashville. There are a lot of people who are like, oh, I didn't get it. I, I've got friends that they're not going to do it either. I don't understand. I don't care that because I feel like it's our duty. Absolutely. Like everybody yeah. like and selfish and not get it. Yes. The people around me. The country Absolutely. would reopen if we didn't get yeah, it. Exactly. So it's like, and then oh, somebody said, said, well, if y'all are getting it, then I don't have to get it. No, that's yeah. so selfish. It's more selfish it is. thing I to say. I can't put something up to say that. Right. <laughs> well, thanks so much for doing this, guys. Guys, guys. I appreciate it. Yeah. Nice to meet nice another to Pennsylvanian, it. kinda. Yeah. yeah. Oh, his mom will definitely claim it. Yes, <laughs> absolutely. No, we're some... she wasn't here. You'd be yeah. here for hours. We are in Gulf Shores today, Alabama. Who would have thought? I mean, I've heard of Alabama, the Florabama line. Isn't there a show on MTV called Florabama? But 
know there's something about Alabama Beach that is slightly different than Florida. I don't know what it is. I can't say that it's anything specific, or it might be just the particular sand that I'm in right now. I'm just pleasantly impressed and surprised. I definitely recommend Gulf Shores. Hey there, bra guy. What's going on? What are you drinking? C4 to wake up. Oh, uh, wake me up before you go, go. I work out, but it's... I'm on the bed to the boat, boat. I wake need me it. up. I know you do, baby. You've been waking up early. This morning, I still slept. You slept, and you were a little bit um, tired, even with that, like, what was it, a latte with an extra shot of... Espresso and T-Way and so, T-Way, you don't even let me speak. You just I got, do because you you're just, just battling <laughs> on about my coffee. It's just gonna end up on the cutting room floor. Nobody gives a shit. Oh, I, I can't believe you tried to wind Tammy up. So this is Tammy Salmon Ground. She loves it. She's given us Destin. She's Wait, why did I try to wind her up? You tried to wind her up, telling her that they imported the sand. Well, that's actually a thing in other parts of like. That's not beaches. here. Are you maybe crazy? not here? But you know that is. That's like thing. something they do in like the hey, Middle East. Hey, look at this. Where's all that coming from? What do you mean? This looks like a bunch of sand that they're putting on no, the beach. No, that was like dirt. That's sand, baby. Get a little closer, look. No, that is brown dirt. That is sand. You don't have your it eyeglasses on. Your Lasik's it wearing might, off. It might be sand, but it ain't white sand like this. It's not a hunky door beyond these trips. Your personal things happen. My Turo, there's a scrape on my Turo card. I'm being attacked on that side. Turo is a car rental company service. And then it's like, we're going non-stop and we're not sleeping and we're, and we're trying to save money. And we were like, I didn't feel comfortable. The bed, I said to you right away, the bed felt like it was stuffed with plastic bags. We're on the road eating garbage food too. It's every day. It's like well, I've food. actually been kind of healthy. Well, he's been getting salads at Arby's and Wendy's. I mean, nobody wants that. I do. You can, I, I'm not that person that can go to, like, Domino's. We went to Domino's last night. He's like, do you have a salad? I got a garden salad but I, with I grilled chicken. I just can't go to Domino's. And, get and then I also salad. went to Taco Bell and got a chicken bowl. Kind of like a low-end Chipotle bowl. Oh, we went to Taco Bell and we got a, a Power Bowl. Is that what they're called? Yeah, it's Power it Bowl. sickening. Oh, no, it mine was, was good. Flat. Well, see, this is the thing. I am more of a food, or I'm sorry, I'm more of a food for function. Like, I don't really care about, like, the taste too much. I just want, like, grilled chicken, veggies, that's it. The chicken was nasty, nasty. I mean, it wasn't that bad. Yeah, I mean, was, what do you like, expect? Compared to Chipotle, I would not... I oh, would no, I'm like, just saying, I, like, if you have limited options and you still want to be healthy, you can make it work. Yeah, I was just like, I mean, I'm just feeling it, you know? It's just like the wear and tear of this. Yeah. yeah. Did you want to get on the vlog? Oh my god, we would love to. We always have to. <gasps> 21, happy birthday! Well, not today. What's your name? Hannah. Hannah hey, Montana. Hey, Hannah. And what's your name? Brooklyn, nice to meet you. That's a cool name, Brooklyn. <laughs> I like that. Okay. I've never been here before, so really? I'm impressed. I'm so impressed. you're originally from where? Oklahoma. Oh, you are? We went to Oklahoma. <laughs> oh, no shit. Why we did were, you come to Oklahoma? We were driving okay. west. Oh, we were, I was like, why'd you come there? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. They weren't. Oklahoma wasn't too much has driving. pretty much nothing. We uh, went yeah, to River Sport and surf in River uh, Whitewater Raft. Yeah, oh, okay. River Sport no, yeah, yeah, I bet that was fun. That yeah, was, that was fun. fun. Okay. It was and his, he has a really good mate that um, he bartended with in Los mm. Angeles who's, who's living there. Who's oh, from nice. there. Yeah. Oh. Um, there during COVID, so we, he was so high. He's like, oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> like, want to hang out with her here. <laughs> you guys should be vlogging. You guys are too cute. I can see. Sure, like interesting stuff or do you have a good personality i mean i don't fucking know because we have like 100 subscribers but we <laughs> start, like, you, have, you have to make a, like you need a video that's gonna look amazing hey the quality a, is on point we yeah. got the equipment we got the 4k well i'm also a mom too so good. Well, yeah i have you a little boy you that's are awesome new. wow I tell us about you that you're only 21 what happened um so I got pregnant at 18. Okay. Very unexpectedly. So, oh, I was like, what? Well, nice, right? I mean, tell us what happened. There's clearly a story um, for a 21-year-old, Evan. I was definitely on birth control. I was on birth control, got 
pregnant. It wasn't like I missed a pill or something. I was right. like, on a shot. Got it yes. every three months. On it like clockwork. And then was sick for like two months. My mom was like, maybe you're pregnant. I was like, no, there's no way I'm pregnant. Yeah. Definitely was pregnant. Oh my um, God. Wow. I got pregnant at 18. Had him at 19. And he'll yeah. be two next month. When he's 20 and oh, you're only 40. That's that's ever happened to me yeah. for sure. And his name's Creed Kingsley. So he like the... Creed Kings, they get him a channel. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I know. I told him I was like, "Say you have to be a badass just because of the name." So well. He's gonna think that Brooklyn's like his sister, probably oh, more than an auntie. I actually have a four-year-old sister, so he is like, yeah, very weird. She's an aunt at four. Super oh, weird. That's, that's so funny. funny. I always like eclectic families like oh, yeah. that. And I, what about you, Brooklyn? What's your story? Yeah, what's your story, oh. Brooklyn? It's been all about your sister really for the last... It's usually always I know. about me. <laughs> <laughs> You're so funny. <laughs> I can understand that. That's, that's okay. That's where she's like your guardian. Yeah. But I literally basically aim. I was like, this year I was like, can I claim her on my taxes? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> dependent. Yeah. You got two dependents now. Yeah. Yes. She is basically in every sport you could probably dream of. Like, so you're the athlete of the family? I do my best. Yeah. yeah. Oh my she's god. In cross country, track, Ooh. cheer, and then she plays competitive soccer and full soccer. When did the braces or the, is it retainer? Or braces? No, it's, when it's, it's braces. I got them. Um, I got them on about a year ago, so I have like six months left with them. Oh, okay. Oh, cool. You're gonna love that. She's Everyone I know, I wanted braces. Everyone I knew, their braces came off. Their like they, they're a whole like, new bitch. Yeah, they're like, <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, thank you guys for entertaining yeah, us. Awesome. I'm so glad you called us over because yeah. it's hard to approach people. I was like, hey, are you me. vlogging? <laughs> we are vlogging. You got it on the money. You got thank it you guys so you. much. And thanks for the advice on the restaurant. Yeah. All righty, so you've heard of this place, Floribama. We're going to the well, we're going to the yacht club, Floribama. The bar is right across the street. What's up? I have a feeling that the yacht club is gonna be nicer. Oh, for sure, for sure, for sure, baby. <laughs> It's a C4. It's not the C4. You've been doing that for years now. For years? Oh, been doing because that we've known life. each other for how You've long? You've been doing that stick hey, for years. Technically, so we met June 2019. Yes, we did. And it feels like I've known you for like 10 years. I know. That's how it all fits. By the way, you are so yeah, I know. I know. I need wow, I can really uh -huh. see it on this. <laughs> This is gorgeous. And that is the Yacht Club. On the other side of the road is the Floribama Bar. That's supposed to be a lot of fun that I have a feeling Franco is going to be more keen to do. So maybe we just check this out and then head out. I'm starting to come back alive. How could you not with this? I've been so crotchety on my videos this morning. So we are entering the Floribama bar that is well known on the show Floribama MTV. Did you know that, bro? I've never seen Floribama. So Floribama. Have, have no <laughs> is that the <laughs> of the show? I look like I'm red on the shoulders. Shit. Yeah. I think he's embarrassed to record it. It's not that kind of place. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Hello. Hey, how are you? How are you? It looks like it's well known, right? Yes, definitely. Yeah, yeah people seem excited to be here. I'm going to try to get a second win from this place. Never. Oh, okay. well, thank you. Yeah, okay. I love this right here. Yeah, thank you. How cool is this? this is, I want a picture of that too. This is the wasted wall. I'm actually excited to be here. Not because of the show, but because my aunt and uncle Nancy and Dwayne. Shout out to Aunt Nancy and Uncle Dwayne for telling me about the Floor Mama Bar. 
That's Let's go. go. Ooh, you better watch out. You almost hit that gentleman. I'm sorry. I didn't mean I to. I had caught that all on film, so you would have been sued. Oh, look at this. Wow, this is awesome. Thank you. Ah, oh, this is so awesome. I personally, this kind of reminds me of like something like Hot and Heifers would do. Oh my god, that's where Caitlin works. I know. Alright, let's go. Food. Let's get um grilled chicken salad. Yeah, I'm gonna eat healthy. What was going on with that <laughs> yacht club? It had like three things on the menu. Well, they're just more of like just people sit there and have a little beer. All right, you might have been looking at the happy hour. hour. I can tell there's not much out there. Not right now, please. We're gonna eat some food. Nom 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 Aren't you glad I took us here? I'm 100% glad. I knew he liked some of my ideas, about 50% of the ideas. It's perfect we're driving and we can't really keep rain. It's like a place that I can want to get. Well, you can have a drink. I will. Maybe that'll wake your ass up to Kyla. Maybe it's some tequila. Is it tequila or tequila? Anything you want. Okay. Anything you want. Anything you want. Anything. Anything. That is good. I love the lemon. That might have been too intimate. That moment was too intimate. No, it's funny. But... <laughs> See, sometimes I make him laugh, even though he's a comedian. Sometimes he gets a good kick out of. Megan goes. Stock person from stand up comedian. I was like, she's too much. I love her. I Megan, if you're gonna say stuff on camera, do your research. <laughs> that was just me. No, I love her. I like, she's, she's a like, sweetheart. She's a comedian, but she's a Megan, comedian. you know I love you. You're a sweetheart. It's it's your turn in stand up comedian. I'll be like, no, I just want to do sketch comedy. Okay. Ryan, we are here at the Floor Bama bar. It's well known. I mean, not to be confused with you the look MTV like show. You long here. You really look like you belong. This was what I, this is what I live for. That hat, and those glasses. Pennsylvania, Pennsylvania. I'm of the show, but Floor Bama the bar has just got a nice character. It's got like a party trashy like you said hogs and heifers it's got that vibe but on the beach why do i feel like alabama side was nicer than the florida side you haven't even seen the florida like De where tammy's talking it's two hours from here destin there was a show called the cut i used to do it all the time the cut i'd say it all the time like there was i forget it was like a female rapper she always got more, she was one of the hosts or the judges. She's like, that cat! Oh yeah, I do remember that. And David that was like, oh my god, I would do it all the time. Anyway, Tammy, if you are seeing this, well, wait, we, you it's be two hours from here. Yeah. And City Tammy, to be honest with you, I'm not like super into beaches. Like, I like them on vacation, but like when it comes to filming and stuff, I don't know if I find them as interesting well, as people. But listen, also the bartender here, which I, she's, she looks like she's probably an owner. She was like, this is our place, and they, that show took it. We didn't get any credit, but then she goes, she goes, and we would never allow the shit that they were doing. She goes, we would never We're allow the We're in the Bible Belt. This is the Bible Belt. We this wouldn't allow that Bible shit at our place. And I was like, what exact shit are you talking about? And she was like, well, yeah, then you did that. Yeah. off each other's backs and all the bars <laughs> and everything. And she's like, if people are doing that, at least they're doing it like on the down low. They're not going right. to be doing it out in public. So yeah. she felt like it was a poor representation of, because she, I guess this is so popular that right. people think, oh, that must be what they're doing over here at Florida, Bama the Bar. You do look like a Cali boy with that blonde hair. 
that long blonde hair. Well, I live in Cali now and change is good and I'm gonna cut it at some point because it's such a hassle. Well, I'll tell you what, the heat will make you wanna cut it. It's just you're always faffing with it and you're always like fussing with it and it's like, well, I don't Well, see, I never that. did fuss with it and Haley told me that's why it looked like shit. <laughs> and I, well, I wanted it to be like hippie that? where it just comes and like, you, know, you see those guys just long hair and it's kind of cool like server and you just think they don't, they wake up like that and it's good. Yeah. But I wake up and my thing is like, fucking good much. Goodbye and good luck. Goodbye and good luck. How? <laughs> good. What is it? Goodbye and good luck from Howie. Goodbye and good luck from Howie. My dad. <laughs>